Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Depending on the time and location you are tuned to our channel, thanks a lot for the visit. You know, he who have nothing to fear, have nothing to panic about. The UAG people are panicking. Ken and Co, they've stayed panicking just because of Prince. You know, and some postings I did. You know, you know, they are now panicking, saying that you see what they are trying to do when they discover that the beneficiaries are trying to get uh, headways, they, they start using uh, unrealistic logic to say that uh, 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 they want to distort this disbursement. These people are really playing game. They are really playing game. Now I understand, they are really playing game. Listen to this, we'll meet at the end of this to dissect things. Morning. Ladies and gentlemen in Grand Ecosystem, good morning, our uh, Bible leader of the person of Apostle Ambassador Dr. Ken Nwakama. Good morning, UAG management and our executives. Good morning, AGPN and ESCOs, headed by the German machine, Abu. Yes, not forgetting. The Niger Delta Strike Force generals and commanders in the nine states of the Niger Delta. I greet you all, commanders. I greet you all. Permit me to, on behalf of your humble self, to disseminate this very salient information to who, to who it is needed to be given. Yes, uh, it has come to our notice, it has come to our decks, and uh, it is pertinent we come to the social space and give a resounding warning to some elements, group of people that felt the only way they will make noise or to truncate a, 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 a going process is to give a petition. Please hear me and get me clear. You petitioner, wherever you're hearing my word, my voice, please be warned. It is not at this zero zero hour or the say ninety nine hour you will start giving your petitioning. You're only telling us that perhaps you have been sent by our enemy or you are a witch. Because there is no reasonable person that will realize that something good is about to drop. And you said it is that time you want to petition. We are privy and privileged to have every necessary information with regard to the phone being in Nigeria and also in CBN. So I will only urge you if you have any doubt about the authenticity of the money, you just go to CBN and make your research and stop this issue of petitioning at this zero zero hour. So therefore, we are passing a strict warning with the Niger Delta Strike Force and I Empire. We are passing a strict warning to you, Mr. or Mrs. Please be caution. Desist from any form of truncation, any form of disabusing the process, or abusing the process rather, disabusing our God given process. Please shun such act because it will be so inimical and also an inhuman to our fellow humans so it, is, it doesn't make any point at this very point for we to start fighting ourselves so you should desist and let us not come for you let us not come for you because it is our bread and butter you are about pouring some deaths on and so therefore we are going to fight back on this note we want to pass a sound warning if this petitioner and a group of persons that want to showcase them, go ahead in doing such, then it is a war you have created for yourself and the Niger Delta Strike Force. And we will find you. We will make research on you. It is like you are, you are, you are even better than the dead man. The dead man rather is better than you. So therefore, let us shun the process of petitioning and share our sword and give the country director the God-given time as they 
are seriously working and we are 100 percent aware of the process and that is why we have not come to fight the process if there's any kangaroo going on who will be the number one force to strike so we want to appeal that all hands should be on deck support the process as we await this disbursement in no distant time thank you very much i come your way my name is ambassador george jp of the nigeria tribe for sure so guys you've listened to everything you've listened to it now your if you are very objective if you are very objective you see the game that is being played now for nearly nearly eight years okay let's remove that eight years apart since december december 27 they said there was going to be disbursement then they now said no that because of the holidays a lot of people are are on holidays that people that to, that is going to do the secretarial work for disbursement are on holidays so they will shift it to first week of january first week of january they came to moot nobody said anything then everybody was afraid to react because the disbursement was at hand then when february ended uh, january ended february this press conference started since this press conference started the game have changed it was when this press conference was kicking off ken came to itv to do broadcast it was when this disbursement was kicking off they started bringing the number the amount first of all they brought that the the beneficiaries are going to get three million while the ceo 20 million then later they brought uh 500 000 ceo uh, 15,000 later they brought 300,000 now they brought 100,000 why was all this shift because of this panic attack of press conference now this wave this frenzy movement of uh, disbursement after Salah came out why were all these things being done because of this press conference so can't we ask ourselves let, the, let this press conference just happen let if 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 let it happen because we've waited for so long now he has come to say there will be disbursement in no distance no distant time and i bet you when there's no disbursement he will come out and apologize to the masses and say he's being used a lot of the escorts that has fallen out with ken come out to apologize to us for being used so how long are we going to play this game how long are we continue to play this game at least the one of the longest games that last is chess chess doesn't last long like this chess lasts long but it doesn't last long like this at least we know football match is 90 minutes every game has its duration but this uag game what is the duration what is the duration so guys i think press conference is the only thing that will liberate us See you on our next update, guys.